everybody's had it. it gets indigestion from time to time that's not an unusual thing but there's a spectrum of disease where some patients get it every day many times a day and it can be life-altering GERD is stands for gastroesophageal reflux disease and it's uh, typically known as heartburn or acid reflux and it's when stomach contents wash back up into the esophagus and even the back of the throat uh, as opposed to going the direction it should be going. Having bronchitis was it was sort of a setback for me and often that would last as long as two weeks and then um, just the horses just um, the sore throats um, I, you know I was just um, I, just being sick you know. Her main problem was that she had trouble sleeping at night. She said many times she would travel and have to sleep flat, she would come back with bronchitis. At home she has her bed elevated and that would solve some of the issues, but when she had to sleep supine it caused her bronchitis. She had several episodes of recurring episodes of bronchitis. And when I saw Dr. Hausman, he was uh, excited about this new procedure. It sounded pretty good to me because uh, the other option would have been the surgery where they take some of the stomach and wrap it so that it closes the, um, the valve. And I had read about the side effects and it sounded like a lot of problems after that I just really wasn't wanting to deal with. And so when he mentioned this procedure, it sounded pretty good. On the Lynx uh, procedure, it's a laparoscopic procedure, means uh, it's performed with you know, four or five little bitty incisions and you wake up at the end of the procedure with, with a couple band-aids on. It takes 30 minutes to an hour to do and basically we take a magnetic device, it's a, it's a magnetic ring, almost like a kid's candy bracelet that we uh, place around the junction between the esophagus and the stomach and it's a, what happens when patients swallow it, it, the magnets are calibrated so they'll open up and allow the esophagus to empty into the stomach, but then the magnets pull back together and they're snug enough to prevent the reflux back up from the stomach into the esophagus. There was not a lot of cutting, there wasn't cutting and stitching. Um, you still had the little incisions because it was laparoscopic. The recovery was so much easier with the Lynx procedure. It just, it was really easy, probably one of the easiest surgeries I've ever had. I mean, um, they took me in, next thing I woke up and was taken to my room and ate scrambled eggs. <laughs> it went smoothly. Uh, this is our first one, uh, but it's a pretty straightforward procedure. The uh, technology is very interesting, but it's very simply designed and uh, pretty straightforward, easy procedure to perform. I don't even know it's there. I've never, I've never felt any different as far as that goes. I have had no sore throats, I've had no bronchitis, nothing like that. Um, I feel great. But new technology is exciting. I mean, it's, it's, you know, the procedure is one thing, but it's the end result that's actually more exciting about the new technology is to see how things turn out, and Ms. Loud has been a great example of that. So, sure, it's nice to learn a new technique and do a new technique, but when it ends up with a good positive result like it did with Ms. Loud, that's where the gratification comes in.